Welcome back to the channel team in episode 20 of the Clean Sweep. This week we've got some of our block management services that we're going to give you a contract tour around. So let's go and show you guys around. So today we're down near the River Medway in Rochester, Kent. This particular contract, we have about 50 blocks that we manage a wide range of services from cleaning to pest control to waste management to maintenance. We carry out block management across Kent, London, the South East and obviously the Medway towns where we're based. So we're going to show you around and explore some of the services that we can offer. So obviously the first thing we would do is the thing that we do best, weekly cleaning of all the common areas. So the lady that comes and cleans this particular contract will vacuum all the common areas from top to bottom, make sure she wipes over all the surfaces, spot cleans all the glass, so when the residents come in, they've got a nice clean building on a daily basis. So to support our cleaning team that carry out cleaning across these 50 blocks, our specialist team carry out a wide range of periodic services across all these blocks. First one is the common area clean to the window, so we use a reach and wash method to clean all the common area windows. We also carry out regular periodics to all 50 undercrofts where the residents park their cars. That involves our specialist team coming down to site. They pressure wash all the floors and make sure all the high levels are clear of any cobwebs and debris so it's nice and clean for anyone that's parking their car underneath. One site-specific periodic that we have to carry out, we have birds that nest on the ledges behind me and unfortunately they put pigeon guano all over the floor so the team have to regularly come down here also pressure wash this area to keep it nice and clean from a health and safety perspective. One of the other periodics we do are the various bin stores that are kept here. This is where all the general waste goes from all the buildings. They get chucked in there. Unfortunately, most of it ends up on the floor. So on a periodic basis, the guys will jet wash these out and make sure they're disinfected. We have a maintenance engineer that comes down to these particular blocks once a week and carries out any reactive maintenance that the cleaner may report. This could be simple things from lights being out in blocks, which is a health and safety issue, trip hazards such as stair treads being loose, and any other general maintenance that the cleaner finds while she's on her travels. As well as the contract general waste management that you've seen in the bin room, we also carry out bulk waste removal. Unfortunately, tenants, when they finish with large bulk items like this sofa you see me on now, they have a habit of just dumping them outside. So what we do is we move them to a centralized point and when there's enough waste, they'll be collected and disposed of. One of the ad hoc services we provide across all our estate management is pest control. As you can imagine, when you're dealing with the volumes of rubbish that we do in these bin rooms, it attracts unwanted visitors in the form of mice and rats. So monthly pest control visits, make sure we keep that at bay for the residents. So some of the contractual information here, we have a cleaner who comes down three days a week to this particular estate. She also spends two days a week on another block management estate that we carry out. She'll come down, she'll do all her daily cleaning that she needs to do and then carry out any reporting that the client likes to see at this particular site. That's all totally bespoke to each client's needs. Some clients like to have that reporting software, some don't, so we'll flex that up and down as per the client's need. She'll report that back to our management team and then they will book in any periodic maintenance work that needs to happen on a weekly basis. So I hope that gives you a little bit of insight into our block management services. As always, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and we'll catch you guys on next week's episode.